How many people on the set of, I believe it was Pitch Perfect 2, uh -huh. that knew who the Green Bay Packers were when they came on the set? Uh, were, were, you were a small subset, or am I just uh, a trying? fair amount? We a had, fair you know, amount. there's like Adam Devine, I know Elizabeth okay, yes. Banks yes. and Max Handelman, our producers and director, they are big sports people. Right. So, and they were the ones that recruited the Green Bay Packers. That I course. do know that. Yes. I, I, I think we did we have Clay Matthews on here saying that he. He got a direct message from Elizabeth Elizabeth Banks and then was very excited about that. Yes. And then found out she was married and then it was a problem. Yeah, but it got us the Packers in okay. the movie. I mean, she really okay. flirted her way to a great sequel. No, I think uh, I think there was a bunch of people on the offensive line. I know David Bakhtiari yes. and a bunch of people like those yeah. guys who was a legendary, you know. Yes player but they, they were huge fans of the first movie and they apparently n rehearsed and knew my entire like my entire finale number they knew they did it in the locker room it went kind of viral and so that's why elizabeth reached out and was like would you want to do a little cameo in the sequel yes and so we were all pumped okay we did not have aaron Rodgers, but we did have jordan Rodgers, his brother who was a bit of a doppelganger <laughs> yeah. so that that's halfway home right exactly there. we were like we have a rogers well, in the sequel and how about the jets now have rogers we do and, we? and and by <laughs> <laughs> I heard we do. I yeah, know he for four snaps. Yeah. And uh and at this point in time he's still he's yet to even tweet out I I do not intend to be the vice president of the United States. Right. So at the if so at at the very least I do believe the Jets offensive line will have a nickname of Secret Service. <laughs> Because yeah. they're protecting Aaron Rodgers. That's and funny. we're building a heck of an offensive line. And by the way, Tyron Smith being added and Moses Morgan being back. And, you know, Vera Tucker hopefully will get through an entire season. Potentially the draft will have another weapon. That is we entirely just, we possible. We need depth there. We need to protect our vice, pre vice president. Vice president, of course, exactly. But, you know, and uh, our and Bakhtiari might be. Is that true? Well, he's available. The Packers are, are moved. They've wow. moved on. I have his phone number. I still really? have his phone number. Yeah, let's I used to always got FaceTime. Anytime you can right imagine. I, 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 By the way, yes, we can imagine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, <laughs> I don't even have my phone's in the, the green phone, room. That's right, we left it in the <laughs> green room. Damn it. Ah, that's the only reason. That's right, the right. reason why we're not <laughs> FaceTiming yeah. David Bakhtiari yeah. right now. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I, you know, I, we, yeah, I, anytime you have an athlete's number, you don't want to abuse it, but you want to be like, hey, good luck today in yeah, the sure. Super Bowl, you know what I mean, or whatever they're doing. That's so cool. Um, How would you like to be a teammate of Aaron Rodgers again and be part of the New York Jets? And Something tells me Aaron's probably doing the recruiting, That's and I don't, I don't need to <laughs> jump right. on board. But um, but no, I'm, I'm excited. It's like one of the few times that a sports organization does a full mulligan. They're like, whoops, didn't do it this year. Right. Didn't, you know, we had certain expectations. You know, they're keeping Salah. They're keeping everyone and they're just gonna we're just gonna try again to run it back, run it back. there's no other yeah. choice yeah. but to run it back yeah there's just it's that simple because um although the jets did kick the tires on every quarterback at the combine out of due diligence but yep. sitting down at 10 there's never they're, they're never going to be able to go and plus that would be insane to use any draft capital on moving up no. to go get a quarterback when you've got all eggs in the Vice presidential basket, That's right? right. Now, and Tyrod you know? Taylor backing him up. That's nothing to sneeze that at. That was uh, that had to have happened. Yeah, well, I mean, that, that we one, need a plan B. One hundred percent had to have happened. Yeah. Catch the Rich Eisen show every single day on the Roku channel, twelve to three Eastern, for free.